Hello, I'm Chris. I'm Kathy, and this is Ladybug. And we just want to take a few moments this week to uh, talk about exam transport and our experiences uh, with being with them so far. Uh, we couldn't say enough good things about exam transport. Uh, Confucius once said, uh, choose a job you love, you'll never work a day in your life. And I believe that's what we've done here because we absolutely love what we do. Um, every week is an adventure. Uh, we get to travel and we enjoy that very much. And be together and um, we started out in Utah this week and uh, went to California. Uh, we have a video of the salt flats in, Cal in um, Utah and the cacti in Arizona when we went through there. Um, and uh, the weather, the weather is so different. It's amazing. We, um, we were in 105 degree weather in California and uh, now we're in Washington and wearing sweaters and mm. uh, it's like 60s up here. So yeah, if you're new to expediting, it's important to bring a change of clothes for all seasons because it does get cold in the summertime in some places. And yep, Ladybug had to wear a sweater, so we have to bring clothes for her too. <laughs> and she mm -hmm. loves working. She loves the truck life. We meet lots of dogs and lots of cats, and and the uh, loves we're at right now in Washington is one of our favorites because it has a doggy park. So she she knows that, and she walks around with a ball in her mouth all day so it's about the third time we've been to the park uh, in one day so she gets them in when she can <laughs> well hope you enjoy the video and thanks for watching
like the Hi guys, um, on our way up to Washington State, uh, we uh, encountered uh, uh, forest fires and um, we got some video of that. It was mm -hmm. about three o'clock in the morning, um, driving yeah. through and it looked like the sun was rising. Um, it was just the horizon was red and we didn't know. We started smelling smoke. And we were kind of in the mountainous area, so thought possibly it was some trucker's brakes, but um, it got smokier and smokier, and all of a sudden it just looked like red lava just coming down. So it was very, very dramatic. I've never mm -hmm. seen anything like it. We got footage of that. Uh, turns out it was like, how much was it burnt? Like 15,000 acres? It started on like 11 acres, but then it spread. And it was crazy. It was huge. But um, the next day, uh, we had another job that was going back across to New York and we, we backtracked across and we saw the firefighters out there. The fires were out but there was smoke just coming from all the different places and the firefighters were out there just sitting on the banks trying to recuperate or whatever and so we thought that was very interesting. We've never seen anything like that. We've seen it on TV from sitting on our couch at home but this is real adventure out here. We see things every day. So many things. Um, also, we went through uh, El Paso, and um, with the shootings at Walmart, we happened to go right by there, uh, and the town was just lit up with signs, uh, El Paso Strong, and um, that was very touching because, you know, we saw that on the news. So, we're out here, and it, it, when you're out here running the states like we are, it really makes the world a much smaller place it does. and you see everything uh, that is on the news and we could be involved in anything or see anything or go by anything at any time um, everybody out here is just real people living their lives so that was very touching so hope you enjoy the video thanks <laughs>